Since I've been here, a lot of donors over the past few seasons have often said to me, why can't we do some Purcell? And that, that is music to my ears. Uh, he is the greatest composer that ever lived out of England. Uh, a composer that had all too short a life. He, he just made it into his 30s. This programme is a, sort of a bit of a potpourri. I've sensed it around the Indian Queen, which I'll talk about more later. But I, in the first half, I've included one or two scenes from his other operas. In the case of the Fairy Queen, of course, it's Shakespeare, incidental music to Shakespeare's Midsummer Night's Dream. And we're including the scene of the drunken poet. Here, the drunken poet comes in and he's being, he's being pursued by two fairies who are pinching him uh, till he's black and blue. Uh, this is a, a wonderful scene, and I'm delighted to, to have over my good friend Jonathan Best, a fantastic baritone, character actor. He will have you all laughing in your seats. But the main piece of the programme is Purcell's Indian Queen. The Indian Queen is based on the play uh, by John Dryden, and it concerns the conflicts between the Mexicans and the Peruvians, uh, who both employ the services of Montezuma, that famous mercenary, who actually works for both sides in this play. But Purcell's music is centred around the Queen of Zempoala, uh, who is having a, a bit of difficulty with her, with her life, and she calls upon the magi magician Ismeron to tell her what's, what's going to be happening in the future. Not a good idea. It's a phenomenal piece. And this is what Purcell's music is. It's always inventive. It's full of extraordinary harmonies. And of course, this is going to be another occasion where all the smaller roles um, are going to be from our own chorus. Uh, there's a lot for them to do. And this is a real special uh, piece for Handel and Haydn Society. And I'm delighted that we've, I've been able to put it into the season.